This is a quick three minutes to create an indoor predicted Wi-Fi heat map. So to start out with, we take a floor plan of the area we're interested in and drop it into the start window. Then we select set as floor plan in new building. The default parameters for the new system are good. We're, we're modeling in two dimensions. We want medium resolution. We want a predicted heat map. The area we're interested in is seven meters by 12. Actually, correction is eight meters by 12. And we're modeling a Wi-Fi network. So we then click create. And we end up with an empty system with the floor plan set. I'm then going to trace out the outline of the structure. So to do that we go to barrier as segment double brick and trace out the outer walls. I'm covering over some of the windows and things for this demonstration but you can also of course go in high detail if you need. I'm going to add internal walls as single brick. There is this, these three in the middle as well. glass window for the front. And then we have a rough outline of the structure of this unit. We then add one access point in the middle at 5 gigahertz. And then we end up with a heat map generated to show an estimated signal strength of the network in this building based on this single access point. We no longer need the floor plan at the moment, so I can click on building, edit, and explain floor plan and deselect show floor plan, and then apply. And then we get the heat map without the floor plan in the way, so we know the signal strength to be expected from this 5 gigahertz access point in this small two-bedroom unit. For more detailed planning and modeling and to utilize the scanning and survey capability of EMSlice, see emslice.com. Thank you.